sorry if I'm looking a little tired and worn out. It has just been a very long, fun-filled Saturday, but I wanted to share this video with y'all. So today I'm sharing three things that I've done within the past two weeks to take my financial trajectory from, from negative to positive. this to this. So the first thing I did was I asked two of my family members to add me as an authorized user to one of their higher limit credit cards. And what this did was basically increase my overall credit amount and shrunk the you know amount of debt that I have, credit card debt that I have. So basically it changed my credit utilization. Um, it took it down. So that was the first thing that I did. And that had a positive impact on my credit like right away. Not a whole lot, but a couple of points. I moving in a positive direction. So check. The second thing that I did was I my fault. The second thing that I did was I came across this video on YouTube that basically talked about creating cash flow with your credit cards in order to pay down your credit card debt. And basically what the lady was talking about was instead of taking your paycheck and paying off your monthly living expenses with cash, taking that cash and putting that to your credit cards and then using your credit card to pay off your monthly living expenses that you can. I know rent is one of those expenses that you may or may not be able to pay on a credit card, gas, electric, um, food, stuff like that. So when I got paid, I basically put that money to my credit cards, which satisfied the minimum payment for that month. And of course, took that amount of debt that I have on that credit card down immediately. And what that does is basically it allows me the ability, it allows me the ability to then make a second payment this month before the due date, which is going to look really, really, really good. So I'm hoping that it will further increase my credit score um, over time. Check. That's the second thing I did. So the third thing that I did was, y'all, I came across this dude named Smitty the Goat from Chicago. And I learned about him through the Finesse's Only podcast. Um, Jonathan DuPont is the dude that created the Finesse's Only podcast. And so Smitty the Goat was a guest. And I, one of his shorts came across my feed where he's basically giving a play to refinance your car from your personal credit into your business name through Bank of America. And he did say you need to have top tier credit in order to make this happen. But then again, he had like a $100,000 car. I mean, my truck nice, but it's not $100,000. But anyway, I tried this on Friday, y'all, and it worked. It worked and my like I said, I got a lot of credit card debt. So the fact that I was able to refinance my truck out of my personal name into my business name. Y'all, I'm so happy. Thank you, G. Like, G. I'm from Chicago, so thank you, G. Like that shit worked. And the beautiful thing about that is that it's gonna take that thirty-two thousand dollars. And auto loan that was on my personal credit, they finna pay that off. My old lender finna pay that off. Boom. So that's gonna get that's gonna look really good on my credit. And it's gonna shrink my um overall debt. And then it's getting added to my business credit profile, which is a awesome thing because it's gonna diversify my business credit portfolio. And this was a, a goal that I had was to purchase a car in my business name uh, within two years of me having my business. I would have had my business established for two years in July of this year. So the fact that I was able to do that, I'm just so happy. So yeah, like definitely find you some solid um, guidance or find you a solid person online that you trust. Um, not that you trust, but that seems trustworthy, that seems like they know what they're talking about. Do your own research, of course, and just jump off the porch and do what you got to do to get where you want to be, like, for real, for real. So 
that's it for now. See y'all later.